A great looking booth will certainly generate interest, but you need to get the bride to stop rather than keep walking by. And there are a few tricks that you can use to facilitate this engagement. You can have some sort of a giveaway. There's all sorts of things that you can stick your name on and give out. And you might find that doing that generates interest. Your goal is not necessarily to have something on their desk with your logo on it. You know, the time window is pretty short for selling weddings. You don't get that. It's just really to get the bride. You're giving away something. She's going to stop at your booth and it might help you generate more traffic. Now, who's heard people complain that, oh, brides that go to bridal shows are only looking for freebies? And this plays right into that. Well, I don't think for a minute that brides are coming, to, spending their day and driving to park and then paying for parking and buying a ticket and spending a few hours of their time I don't believe that they are doing that just to get a free piece of cake or a luggage tag. When I hear people say, oh, those brides were only there for the freebies, it's because they're not giving away anything and they see their neighbor getting a whole lot more traffic at their booth because they are giving away something. So again, I'm not telling you that everybody needs to give away stuff, but it might be something that would help you generate some traffic. You can offer some sort of an interactive activity or drawing or just anything like that at your booth. Again, the goal here is to get people to stop long enough that you can engage them. And you know, I'm not saying everybody needs to do spin the prize wheel. It's a little cheesy, but it can work. But some kind of drawing, some kind of something to get them, again, just to stop and take some action so that it gives you a couple of seconds to engage them. You can also have some sort of a discount or a special offer. The days of we don't discount are long gone. We live in an age of Groupon and Living Social and Joseph A. Bank, buy one suit, get 10 free, whatever they're doing this week. Consumers have been conditioned to look for deals. I'm not saying they're looking for cheap. They are just looking for deals. You need to build into your price. And this is not just at bridal shows, this is all the time. You need to build into your pricing the ability to be able to give a discount bonus upgrade special offer. Now, the problem with discounts percentage discounts is that thanks to Macy's and Kohl's and whatnot, they don't, discounts don't get sexy till they're like 40 or 50 percent. And most of you are not going to build that much into your pricing to be able to do that. So I don't suggest that a 5 percent or 10 percent discount is going to move the needle at all because it's just not, you know, in this, in this environment that we're in, it's not very sexy. But I would say that uh, instead, some sort of a bonus upgrade, something like that is better than an actual dollar or a percentage discount. 